children, what's the matter? Mom and Daddy. Oh, it's such an honor to meet you at last. I've heard so much about you from the other animals. <laughs> what a charmer. Now, friends, what's troubling you? Gendere doesn't want to help us and answer our questions. But how can we solve the mystery without asking questions? Asking questions is very important. It shows you are curious. And being curious can help you discover so many incredible new things. Curious? Oh, I like it. But how can I be curious and ask questions if no one ever wants to answer them? Well, sometimes people are just busy doing their own things, Amani. But that's okay. You can just ask them, do you have time to help me? And if they don't have time? Then you can ask, when is a good time for you to help me? Mama Dege, do you have time to help us? Of course, my friends. How can I help? Oh, well, uh, we, we want to find some clouds. We think maybe that's where the water goes when it gets sucked up into the sky. so we can see how the water gets into the clouds. Is that a cloud dance? <laughs> I'm afraid that just won't do. You need to do a bit of this, and a bit of this, and definitely some of this. It's easy, just follow me. Now dancing doesn't really make the clouds come, but it sure is a fun way to pass the time while you're waiting. Oh, we'll finally get a glimpse of that backwards rain. Hey, look! I know Mama Dega said the clouds do hold water, but I still don't see any backwards rain. <laughs> uh, excuse me, Mama Dege. Uh, do you have time to help? Uh, uh, excuse me, Ma Mama Dege. Do you have time to help? Uh, I think we might have to try asking someone else. Zakiko comes back. We have to get to the bottom of this mystery. And fast. You're right. We must try. Let's go over what we know. The water started off down here in the trough. We know that for sure. And then Mom and Dege told us that the water does get sucked up into the sky, where it forms clouds. Oh, and those clouds fill up with droplets until they're too heavy to hold any more. Then they drop them down as rain. And we know that because, oh, oh, well, we've all seen rain before. <laughs> How does the water get sucked up into the clouds? Well, uh, you know, Amani, even if we haven't managed to solve the mystery, all this asking questions business has sure been fun. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh
What is this? It's sort of cloud-like. Oh, that. That's just steam. You know, like a sort of vapor that rises up from hot water. Oh, vapor rises from hot water. Mm. Vapor rises from hot water. It must be the sun that sucks up the water. Because when the sun makes the water hot, it turns into vapor and rises up and forms clouds. And then when the clouds are too heavy, the water falls down again as rain. Oh, oh, and then when it gets hot again, it must happen all over again. Like a great water cycle. Ah, <sighs> what an amazing world we live in. Oh, well done, Amani. You've done it. You've solved the mystery. But I couldn't have done it without you, Spikey. We solved the mystery together. Quick! We need to cover the troughs before all the water turns into vapor and disappears. Zekiga won't be happy if we let his water go to waste. <gasps> He's back! Are you right, Yamani? Oh, I'm Zekigo. You're back. I am indeed. And with a whole lot of new farming tips to try out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Can, can somebody help me? <gasps> Spikey! Uh-huh. Who is your friend? Spikey, sir. Ah, come inside, come inside. You must be hot out here. You know, Zekigo, you're right. Sometimes we do forget to see opportunities to learn. But today, I saw one. You did? That's great. Me and Spikey here came across a mystery. And that meant we must try to solve it. We knew that water disappeared from the trough outside, but we didn't know why it had vanished. So we did some investigating and asked questions, and finally we cracked it. So what had caused the missing water then? Us! We caused it, because we were the ones who left the troughs uncovered. So that's why you were in such a hurry to cover them. Well, it wasn't all our fault. It was the sun's fault too, because when water gets hot, it turns into vapor and rises up into the air. Ah, so you have discovered evaporation. Evaporation! Yeah! And when the vapor goes into the sky, it becomes tiny droplets of cold water or ice, which gather together and form clouds. Ha! Huh? And you learned about condensation too. Oh, is that what it's called? Condensation! Cool! Well, once that happens, the clouds get too heavy and the water droplets fall down as rain. Also known as precipitation. And then the whole cycle begins again! Ah, I say, you two have uncovered the mystery of the missing water and the water cycle. It's true! Solving mysteries and asking questions can help you discover all sorts of amazing things. I can't wait to tell the others. Ooh, why don't we show the others? Question three. How can we show the others the water cycle? Water, 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 ooh, yeah, yeah. Water, 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 ooh, yeah, yeah. When the sun is shining, the water gets hot. It turns into vapor, rises up, up, up. It's called evaporation, evaporation. It's part of the water cycle, evaporation. The vapor gets so cold up in the sky. Turns into drops of water or ice. The drops then gather together to form the clouds way up above. It's called condensation. Condensation. It's part of the water cycle. Condensation. Water, water, water. heavy they can't hold no more drops the water rains down on all of us it's called precipitation precipitation it's part of the water cycle precipitation 
The rain seeps away down into the ground Collecting ponds and streams all around It's called collection Collection It's part of the water cycle Collection Water, 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 who yeah, yeah 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 Never miss out on new Ubalu Kids videos ever again. Subscribe today and become the first to know every time new fun educational content is available. Simply type Ubalu Kids English on the search bar. Click on the Ubalu Kids English channel page. Click subscribe on the right hand corner of your screen. What are you waiting for? You are three easy steps away from joining the Ubongo Kids family.